I know you played Rasmus Dalin a couple times this year. What kind of challenge have they posed for the defense? Dalin? Yeah, obviously he's, uh, he's agile, he makes plays, he's, he's a defender, but he's got the skill set of a forward. Coming in with the expectations that he had on him from everybody else and probably from himself as well, it's not easy to, uh, to live up to those. There was a reason uh, that's why he was the uh, first, uh, first overall and uh, you know he's just an unbelievable player. It's hard to believe that he's still as young as he is with the way that he's playing. There it is, NHL history for Rasmus Dolan. I think he was very deserving of being here. Uh, I know he's added late, but uh, I think he deserved to be here regardless. Dolan, he was just making things happen here. What kind of sticks out is how he snowed uh, at Josh Norris in the first game of the year his size uh, to be able to move uh, move as well as he does on the ice. I think he has a good flow to his game and he understands uh, timing. He's put up enough against us this year that uh, I probably don't need to go looking out online to watch, to watch him stuff. I think he's a you know, great player. He's going to be a you know, great D for a long time. Do you need skates? You know, it's a very nice thing uh, to do, hang out with kids and um, have a good time. Otherwise, I would just sit on my couch back home or not doing anything. So it's, I'm sure I'm going to have a ton of fun here. What's up? How are you guys doing? What's up, dude? Hey. Oh, nice. I like that. You want, I'll get you one right You want a picture first? Yeah, sure. All right. All right, yeah, look at that. That's New Jersey. Oh, wow. I really like your jersey. What do you want to do? Want to skate around? Yeah, let's skate around. All right, let's skate around. Five minutes for fighting. Oh, no. Oh, no. Five minutes? Yeah. Ah. Get me out of here! Oh, thank you, you saved me. That was awesome, that was a lot of fun. Now I will uh, go home, make some dinner and get ready for the game tomorrow. Thompson trying to get off the wall. Rough ride from Chatfield, he'll pin him to the wall. But he's in some pain. Change. H. Thompson slowly makes his way down the tunnel. You hate to see Thompson injured here as he's preparing to go to his first All-Star game in Florida. Rasmus freaking Dolly, and here you are. 24 hours ago, you thought you were about to get a few days off, and now here you are in Florida for All-Star weekend. What is the last 24 hours, I guess, been like for you? Yeah, uh, after the game, um, Kevin Adams came up to me and asked me uh, if, if I was going to the All-Star and I was like, all right, sure. Um, <laughs> went home, um, packed all my bags. Uh, after games, it's always tough to sleep, but then I had, uh, had to wake up five in the morning and come here. But yeah, I can't complain now. It's, uh, it's nice weather. And, yeah, the weather helps, right? Yeah. yeah, you guys have a good view there, right? This is okay. Yeah. yeah. Supposed to go to Bahamas. Which NHL player is like the best guy in the locker room to be around? Uh, Tage Thompson is a good one. Uh, he never uh, shuts up. He keeps the locker room loose and uh, he keeps it funny. I, I like it. It was supposed to be his first All-Star experience and if his body doesn't feel right, he can't do anything about it. So I'm, uh, I'm very happy to be here. Uh, I'm going to have a lot of fun. What's up, bro? How are you doing? He's good? Yeah. You? Shabr Shan. The best shoe game is me. Show, show your hair. Are you, are you willing to do that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, this is all I have. Put a lot of effort into doing the right things. Eat right, sleep right, and work hard. Being in the gym more. It's a, it's a mix of everything, but I, uh, I took the next step. We're about to walk over to this jet ski place. Driving some jet skis, have some fun. Um, enjoy Florida. I have my girlfriend, Carolina, uh, my brother, Felix. It was a short notice, but um, 
he flew over from Sweden, so he flew in yesterday. Like a short bit after the game, I guess, uh, Rasmus called me. It was 4 a.m. in Sweden, I think. Uh, he asked me, like, do you want to go to Florida today? <laughs> At first I was shocked because I knew Tage was going, so I didn't really know what he was talking about. But, you know, in the back of my mind, I was like, is it All-Star? He said, uh, yeah, I, I made the All-Star team because Tage is injured. So I was like, yeah, sure, let's do it. And uh, six hours later, I was on a flight uh, over here. So, yeah, crazy couple of hours, but yeah, I'm so, so, so good to be here. So you're the older brother, right? Yeah. Where, was there ever a point where you were better at hockey than him? Uh, yeah, actually, but those years were few, maybe 14. He got better and better and better, so yeah, I guess at that time. <laughs> this guy has more edge than me. He, uh, he, his switch is flipping like this. I've never seen anything like it. Yeah, you'll see on the jet ski today if we race or something. <laughs> yeah. Is this a good jet ski day? It's the best jet ski day we've had in a while. It Why? is? Look at how nice it is. You see how nice it is out there? There's no waves. No waves, it's beautiful out there. Do you see that every day? When it's waves, it's also nice because it's no, something it's else. No, nice it's nice like, when there's waves because it's fun to jump. Yeah, in. I know, but right? at the same time, like, it's also really fun when it's like this because then you can just hold. Yeah. You can tell we're from Buffalo, we don't have any ocean shoes. <laughs> True. Oh. At the end of this thing, he will be red. I promise you. <laughs> have to worry about anything except for this throttle right here. All right? There's no brakes, no reverses. So you ever want to stop or slow down, just go ahead and let it go. Very simple. So basically, what we're going to do is put the ski in the water. You're going to hop on the back. and go out slowly to that big orange triangle right there. All right, you ready? You can go ahead and hop back oh, on. Wish me good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. That'll be the last time you will see me. All right. Grab one. Good. Okay. All right. So you can either hold on to him or back here. There's a little bit of hand wash. So hold on to That's all I had today. <laughs> Let the fun begin. Oh. Hockey fans, let's meet your NHL All-Stars looking to show off their shot strength. From the Buffalo Sabres, Rasmus Dali. Oh, you have, the, you have the Buffalo jerseys. Yeah. Right by the... Here's Pedersen second. Yeah. I am nervous. I, me too. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that hard? That hard? Oh, that's good. That's good. Top two. 103.3 now. Here comes the 10 2. I don't know. Oh! Woo okay. Triple digits, but not quite ahead That was his goal. That was the that was the main goal. And the winner is from the Vancouver. I guess Sweden. Sweden. First shot's 97. What are you thinking after after the first shot? Uh, I kind of knew I had more in me. Uh, so I, I got very pumped after my first shot, so um, it was a great start for me. Who do you think Tage would have hit? Uh, one of four. 
it sucks that it's not here. He cares a lot about family and friends. When you're a friend to him, you're you're, you're family right away. And you know, me me as a brother, I can say that, but I know it all his friends, you know, both back home and in his team, you know. Like Cassie was home for a week this summer. I mean, they always talk about this like brotherhood and you can really like see it because it it's always been that way since we were kids. The team is family and the fans, they're a family. When he can open up and show his true self, I feel like now he's more himself than five years ago. How can you not love him? <laughs>